Hey everyone, Lucy B here coming at you from her classroom. Yes, yes. And guess what? It is Healthy Heart Month. Yes, yes, yes. Healthy hearts, healthy hearts, healthy minds, healthy bodies. Yes, yes, yes. So, as most of you know, I'm an English teacher here at Houston Go School on, but I also teach jump rope after school <laughs> and I do it in my classroom so what I usually do is I set up all four stations so right behind me station one uh, station two station three and station four with the red handles can you see it yeah so what I try to do with the ropes the ropes are of various lengths and um, I have the kids oh I better do this <laughs> I have the kids uh, just uh, do different tricks and uh, with the ropes of various lengths. And um, also I try to focus on speed, endurance, and stamina because for a healthy heart, you need to keep that blood pumping for at least 15 to 20 minutes at a time um, to get maximum benefits. So, uh, so this month I'm really gonna try to pump it up with my kids and uh, try to add in a lot of more variety than what we've been doing, although we do do a lot of variety. <laughs> um, anyways, so to all you teachers out there, try to incorporate the jump ropes in your class during breaks. It really does work. 10 to 15 minutes, 20 minutes I like, <laughs> of jumping goes a long way in terms of getting the kids to stay more focused, more tuned to their studies, and overall better mood, I think. Yes, <laughs> it works for me. So again, happy heart month. I'm actually pushing it to the end of March. So really doing um, healthy heart jump rope challenges for the kids and for my colleagues as well, uh, right through the end of March, um, because again, healthy bodies, healthy minds, better mood, and a happier time here at school. All right, guys, take care. Bye.